touring the South in a trailer are Donald and Dewey and Huey and Louie and a mascot named Cheldenham. What's wrong with you, Donald? Why are you stopping? Your mascot is chewing up our window curtains. Ever since you tried to pick up that brute in the desert, he's been making a mess of our trailer. Can you wait for those tickets, Chipmunk? And stop ramming your swords into my tutu here. Don't be hard on something there, Monkey Donald. I was only making a mess for myself. And my tutu here. I'll get my tickets. I'll catch him at last while he'll be cozy. Mighty cozy. I'll lock him in this drawer. Press the dark on key. Mommy choking on Pickett. I lost the door on keys. Choking him, Pickett. Why is that dark dog Chipmunk? It's dark outside. We left the door open. Dylan, quick, jump in the car. We'll drive away and miss him. No, no, Auntie Daddy. Chucky Lab is our only pet! Don't love him! Shut up! Last Kramer! How the hell do you do this, Pretty Fields? Stop bothering! Now, where was that dog toilet listening to? I was here when you left the door! Chucky Lab was the dog toilet! Chucky Lab! Chucky Lab! Chucky Lab! Chucky Lab! It's going. Oh well, catch the spray key in the drawer by the seat. Lucky I kept the three key in my pocket. Going. Catch the drawer is the one that's locked. And then Tim won't have the key. I'll have to get the spruce on around in the car and pry the drawer open. First, I'll close the drawer to keep that key key from sticking back in. Huh? What? Choke it out, get the drawer key. Are we not now? Yes! The door key is done. We can't drive anywhere for help. We're stuck, and it's beginning to rain. So... All just a lot comes from having a mascot. That night, <laughs> Chipmunk talk for... It's cold. I better get square with that old boy that furnishes the groceries. <laughs> I'm stroking him. He will get the keys. I said Rado has little teeth, but right now I only want to get warm. Are you still buying chocolate lab on the dragon? I hug him with the gold of Brandon Chewy. Next morning. Just because he returned my keys, it's no reason why I should take the Steve back into the family. Scram, chocolate lab. Don't be a mascot to somebody that needs bad luck. From now on, there will be no more pets. Mascots or otherwise. That evening, they stop by the sea. This spot will do for a few days, fishing. No sooner do the kids alight than... A baby alligator. What do you make to work you for pet? Alligator, can we have a new mascot? Guess it won't we'll take his. We guarantee. Ah. I said you can't have any bats. Oh, wow. 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 Oh, Captain Wonky Dragon, we'll take awful good care of little Al. I said, yes, I love myself. 
when I just started the world to kill those kids who haven't got Have you got alligatorism or slashless? Yes, sir. For rent or for sale. I want to run several different slashless for a few days. Soon? I am here with your trains. Well, they'll be handed to my trainer. We'll put little Al in the shoebox. It's just the right chance to make him a bed. Tomorrow, we'll kill him only and buy him some tender fresh for his breakfast. In the darkness. <laughs> now to drain little Al for a bigger tender. And then comes the dawn. Oh my heavenly days! What's happened to little Al? He just threw a little boys. You better tell him some eats. He's most likely very hungry. Now when I'm done, Al did a bigger tender. The kids return with little Al's breakfast. Here you are, Al, friend! Oh, wow! Okay, Tony, is it normal for alligators to grow fast? I suppose so. After all, they are voracious eaters. That part looks starved. I'm sure you can bring them with that fish. Oh, Tony, Tony, this could become expensive. We've brought a goddess with the fish already. <laughs> Let's begin lessons. Again, the kids return. Just know the fish won't feel Alfred. I don't have to, or we'll go broke. Say no more, we're bankrupt. After that, can we give Alfred the submarine? We decided we got his way. Don't run into the bed, sir. That's right, Uncle Dylan. You will pass. Very well. Catch the rule of this family from now on. And so it is. Until that afternoon. Blah! Huh? Hello, you little sawed off mess of shark bait. <laughs> Isn't that cute? You look like a burglar to me. What if he makes a wonderful pet? He does. Get over, you roadhog! <laughs> that bird is a character! You're a character, not ours! Hey, didn't you see that stop sign? No, where? I don't like your ugly face, copper! Huh? Smart guy, are ya? I didn't say anything. My minor bird can. What minor bird? Where? Stop! I flew away! Soon... Just as the gates of red did cast us. The gates would have been if your bird story would not see the bird. No matter is your turn now. I hear a laugh about us. Daddy, if we could just get outside and catch him. Hey, look! The king of what gets things on the table. Yikes! I was just thinking, if we only had chocolate lab now. Yeah, chocolate lab! Outside. Ha 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 ha! Did I hear somebody speak my lowly name? It can't be that anyone wants a poor outcast chipmunk like me, but I'll take a look. Chocolate lab! Chocolate old boy, you're back on the gravy drive and you just do one little drive for us ducks. Will he? Ha! Does that duck think I haven't learned which side of my butter the bread is on? So the minor bird has to talk to the right people and square the ducks with the law. Sour grapes! Blah, blah! Case dismissed. And all is well with the duck family again. And what can I what can I tell you my mind about ducks? But here, Chocolate Ham, have a little ear of torn. <laughs>